After omnibus letter motions were filed on May 13th to seal important data about papers related to remedies, the case between Ripple XRP and the U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission CC took an interesting new turn today. The way things have been going lately is not normal. Jonathan Billich, who is the chief financial officer of Ripple, has signed a statement supporting the company's decision to seal the records. A well-known lawyer named James K. Cat Bethelon was told about this. Ripple has asked Judge Torres to keep some records secret that have to do with the SEC's move for judgment and remedies. It has been found that an amazing 280 million XRP tokens have been sent through Ripple and to Seeks during this request. We will talk about the changes that happened after omnibus letter motions were filed and what Ripple's chief financial officer had to say about the motion in this meeting. This week, 279.97 XRP was sent between Bitstamp and Ripple by unknown addresses, as shown by. Information made easier to understand by the blockchain watcher called Whale Alert. A well-known XRP whale named RZN kept sending coins to Bitstamp. The most recent move it made was taking 29.97 million XRP off of the market. A lot of people were also interested in the deals that were left, though. These transactions showed that XRP was sent from Ripple to an unknown address by in an unknown bank. The first transfer showed that 150 million XRP were sent using Ripple to a certain address. The address was given in the first transfer. This address sent an extra 100 million XRP to a different address that the user did not know. While this was going on, Ripple's chief financial officer said the following in his comment about the company's highly private information. This is my declaration in support of the changes Ripple wants to make. These are exact financial numbers from Ripple's non-public audited financial statements or numbers that are made from those statements. They are broken down into three groups. There are very private and sensitive financial terms in Ripple's contracts with third parties. And there is also very private and sensitive information in Ripple's internal financial records that are related to business goals. The price of XRP has gone up by 3.20% in the 24 hours since this story was written. It is now worth $0.5071. The 24-hour trading volume of the token went up by a huge 44.20%, hitting a total of $859.07 million. Following the latest developments in the lawsuit and the big whale activity that was mentioned earlier, the Ripple back token's price went up. This happened because of these two things. Coin market cap data also shows that the XRP market is going up at the time this article was written. The overall amount of money in open interest went up by 3.37%, making it $571.21 million. Then, the amount of money in derivatives volume went up by 42.05%, making it $794.09 million. The token created waves of hope, with more trading going on and investor interest growing. Even so, the price of the token has been pretty unstable ever since the American blockchain payments business started a legal fight with the U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission. Anyone interested in the cryptocurrency market is still keeping an eye on XRP in case the price changes again. Both sides have until May 20th to send in letter briefs opposing the omnibus letter moves.